Hello, meeting planners. It's Christoph Trapp, Chief Content Officer at Meetings Today. I'm here with Steve Conklin at the Marquise Marriott in Chicago. They opened in 2017, as we shared with you previously. Now, what's new here is you opened a food hall maybe a year after. Correct. That is correct. In an open space that we're looking for a vision, doing something for our customers and also our locals um, to try out. So we have a food hall that has five distinctly different dining options. So first one is the Wing Warrior, which you see here. It's, it offers incredible pizzas that are handmade. We've got right here our own hearth in regards to making our, our own pizzas. Uh, the, the wings here are phenomenal, spi spicy, but then you also have incredible salads. Uh, so that's one option right here. And is it um, is it only meant for guests, but it's all it's it's also meant for people coming in, right? That is correct. We've got great city, uh, city, uh, sitting outside, so our locals right right coming right from the park, right across the street, come right in the side door and they can enjoy. And so you uh, you have an event here. You can rent this whole space, or we can. You can do the entire, or you can take half of it. I will tell you what's what's been new for us: mm -hmm. our rehearsal dinners. Uh -huh. You know, looking for that unique space, kind of fun yeah. space before the weddings. They love taking over this entire space and having fun with it. Fantastic. Now, uh, I, we are seeing an indoor food truck, which is, I can attest, is a new trend. Yes. I did see that uh, recently. I want to say the Minneapolis airport. I think that's where I saw it. I saw it somewhere else. What? Tell me about that uh, trend and what's the thinking behind that? Well, food trucks, you're, you're spot on. I mean, food trucks are, are, are in right now, yeah. and it, they're also very versatile, but it's very, very unique. Cute story about this one here is we purchased this food truck yeah. from somewhere outside of Tennessee. Before we thought it was going to be here at a certain time, the windows went up mm -hmm. before the truck arrived. Oh. So we had actually had to cut the truck in half to actually get it into the building. So now the Argosy, that's what it's called, Argosy. That is a soup and sandwich, incredible freshly made sandwiches and soup every single day. Um, but because it's so versatile, I will tell you, come uh, the end of July, it's going to become more of a taco because there's been a really, really big focus on tacos. Um, we see a lot of food trucks in the in, inside, you know, in the corporate side of Chicago. So that's going to become more of a taco truck. Fantastic. Uh, great windows, great outside lighting coming in as well. And open 2018, um, so about a year after the hotel opened in Chicago, right near the convention center. You are correct. Connected to the convention center. Connected to the convention yes. center. Yes. And then you actually have a revelation here. Um, and that is really your specialty coffees. Okay. So when you want that triple latte with a sprig yeah. of this, they'll make that for you. But the pastries are phenomenal. And I will tell you, if you're not worried about your waistline, the desserts... They're single serving desserts with mini pies and mini custards, uh, fresh, made fresh daily. They're absolutely phenomenal. Mm -hmm. And then around the corner is a potato bar. So your baked potato with all the fixings you can imagine, everything you probably would have at home, we've got it here and then some. Um, and that's probably out of all this, I'll tell you the amazing thing is, our potato bar, out of all the options, is probably our most popular. Fantastic. Steve, thanks for the overview and uh, appreciate it.